In today's video, we're gonna work on the key, the key things you need to know to hit the 100 yard shot. Let's go. All right, here we are. Thanks for stopping by. We are working on the 100 yard shot. The most common, one of the most common shots we have. Everybody wants to lay up to that number and it's just something good to practice. You always see the 100 yard marker at the range. So how, what are the things we need to know to hit the shot awesome every time? Thanks for stopping by. By the way, if you like the video, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. If you haven't done so already, hit the bell so you don't miss anything. Also, be sure to pick up your nice little leather, uh, synthetic leather, you know. Uh, Mr. Short Game logoed alignment stick cover, link in the description below. Get them while they last, all right? They're pretty cool, dig them. Uh, let's get on it. Okay, the first thing, step one, you've got to know, it all starts actually on the practice range. Never, ever in your whole entire life hit Full swings to 100 yards. Always do like a three quarter style swing to the 100 yard sign and mix it up. Hit like pitching wedge, nine iron, eight iron, gap, whatever you can just, you want to hit three quarter shots to the 100 yard because that's where you're gonna have the most control. So when I'm on course, 100 yards, I can hit my 60, 100 yards if I really wanted to, but I don't like it. I like my 54. That's like, you know, right there, 95 yards. It's like three quarter swings to 100. It's perfect for me. So I want to go with that mindset, three quarter style swing. That's step one. So next up, and I say this all the time with wedge shots and pretty much every shot in your bag, do not put your hands forward, okay? Don't do that. You want your hands center, center setup, center setup, center setup with everything. So you gotta be here with the center setup because if you go too far forward, you're gonna come too steep and you don't want that here. No good. This is good, center. got to have that center set up. Okay, next up here, number three step. Here's what I always say, I say, you hear this a lot, be aggressive, be aggressive. What does that even mean, be aggressive? Like, okay, argh, no, that's not what it means. Here's what it means, it means, when I say it at least, it means I want you to accelerate through the ball. Now that's why we're taking a shorter swing, because when you get too long, you decelerate at the ball. That means you're slowing down, and you're doing that and then you hit it bad and nothing works out good. So that's why I want short, I want the fastest part of your swing to be right down when your hands get low, I want hips and hands to accelerate at the same time, okay? You're in here, wait, just, you're here, you're here, you're here, and then once your hands meet your hips, that's where I want it connected. Hands in front of my body, everything's connected here. Once I feel I'm here, that's when I'm accelerating. The fastest acceleration in my swing is at that point, down in here. Whew. That's what be aggressive means. Go fast in the, in the impact zone, the critical zone right in here. That's where you accelerate, right in there. So there's one more, if you just do those, those three, you're good, you're set, you don't have to worry about anything. If you want a little extra credit, you wanna do a little extra work here. This is where I like to turn the screw move, okay? Right here, loosen the screw. You're loosening that screw. Unless you're left-handed, then you're tightening the screw. Make sense? And this is where you do that. You're here, you're short. Right as you transition into the downswing, that's where I want this feeling here turning the screw right then and there. And then keep everything else. You gotta have all the other three pieces first, and then you can turn that screw a little bit, and that will help flight that ball lower. You'll get a little more distance out of it, and uh, cause I like a lower shot with my wedges into the green. A lot more control, a lot more spin, a lot more precision. So right in here, here, turn the screw right there on your way down.
So those are the, the those are my four main keys that I like to focus on when hitting the 100 yard shot, okay? You're taking a three quarter swing. So don't use a full swing on here. Make sure your center set up. Make sure you're accelerating through and then just turn the screw. Loosen the screw a little bit on, on your transition to your downswing. And you'll start hitting those suckers really close to that hole. Have a much better success from 100 yards and in. Hope this is helpful. Hope this tightening up your game, your short game, you're getting better, you're getting more birdies, you're having more fun out there. Thanks for watching. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Love you guys. I'll see you next video.